there are seven symptoms that your blood oxygen level is low. As you breathe in through your lungs, oxygen is taken from the air and transported by red blood cells throughout your body. This oxygen is essential for your internal organs, tissues, muscles, and cells as it allows them to produce energy. Unfortunately, many people experience low blood oxygen levels, which can gradually harm the cells in their heart, liver, and brain. A number of different factors can cause this. Emphysema, bronchitis, and other chronic lung conditions smoking cigarettes can reduce your blood's ability to store oxygen by changing hemoglobin levels, which can lead to COPD or pneumonia. High levels of stress can also contribute to COPD. Hormone cortisol and anxiety can cause hyperventilation during panic attacks, upsetting the balance of oxygen and carbon dioxide in your blood. Excessive sugar consumption can also cause your blood to become more acidic. In addition, a lack of certain nutrients may result in anemia or low antioxidant levels. If untreated, low blood oxygen levels can lead to hypoxia, which can seriously harm your internal organs. In this video, we'll discuss seven warning signs and symptoms that indicate low levels of oxygen in your blood. Please note, however, that this video is only intended for educational purposes. If you have any medical concerns, you should always speak with your doctor. Number 1 Dizziness and Weakness If you ever feel dizzy or extra weak when you get up or do easy things like walking, it might be a sign that your blood doesn't have enough oxygen. You might also notice things going a bit fuzzy around the edges of your vision, and you might even have quick moments where everything goes dark for a second. These funny feelings could mean that your muscles aren't getting enough oxygen, which makes them feel weak. Number 2 Rapid Heartbeat The average person usually has a resting heart rate ranging from 60 to 100 beats per minute. To measure it, place your first two fingers on your wrist's inner side. If your heart rate goes beyond this range while at rest or if you can hear it while lying down, it might indicate low blood oxygen levels. This means your heart has to work harder to pump more blood due to insufficient oxygen supply. Number 3 Muscle Cramps in Chest If you often have chest pain, muscle cramps, or heart cramping, also called angina, it might suggest low blood oxygen levels. To help with this, try adding more electrolyte minerals, vitamin E, and B vitamins to your diet. Later in the video, we'll explore more ways to boost oxygen levels. If you find this info useful, please consider liking the video, subscribing to my channel, and turning on notifications for my latest health and nutrition. Number 4 which is heavy legs. If you get breathless easily when going upstairs or a gentle slope, it's probably due to low oxygen in your blood. You might feel your thighs and calves getting really heavy, which means your muscles aren't getting enough oxygen. Another possibility is a weak heart caused by low fitness or not enough vitamin C or E. These deficiencies often lead to that heavy feeling in your legs. Number 5 involves your nails. Take a look at your fingernails. If they're pink and smooth with faint vertical lines, that's a good health sign. But if they're pale with a lighter strip on top, that could mean anemia. Anemia happens when you don't have enough hemoglobin, which carries oxygen to your nails. Also, if your nails break easily, are brittle, or have deep ridges instead of lines, it could suggest anemia and maybe nerve issues too. Number 6 Blue Tinge Appearing on Your Skin Sometimes you might see a blue tint on your skin or lips, called cyanosis. It happens when tissues don't get enough oxygen. Cyanosis can happen suddenly and might come with shortness of breath. If this happens to you, it's really important to get medical help right away. Number 7 Which is Confusion When your brain doesn't get enough oxygen, you might feel confused, tired, and irritable. This can happen if you lack vitamin B1, thiamine, which can harm your brain's nerves. Such deficiency often comes from eating too much sugar or refined carbs. If you notice these symptoms, see a doctor. They'll use an oximeter to check your blood oxygen levels. A normal reading is 95 to 100 percent, but consistently below 92 percent suggests an issue. 
you can also buy a pulse oximeter for home use. These inexpensive devices clip to your finger. Thanks for watching our video on the 7 signs of low oxygen in your blood. If you found this information helpful, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more health tips and insights.